go figure, we are in tiny house. Tiny circle and it's in a tiny house and it's, it struck me that, uh, you know, this would be perfect to, to talk about. Because uh, if I can tell you a little bit, we feel sometimes, uh, you know, metaphorically even, small in the world. The world seems so big. You go out so scary and so big. The idea that you create a space that is uh, relative to your size as a human being is unheard of. Everybody. You know, a, a lot of people who are in this movement uh, are about um, minimizing their footprint in, in the world. I find living in a tiny house, uh, I am much more acquainted with the outdoors. Yes. For instance, if you keep an eye on that little knot hole in the walnut tree out there, uh, there's a squirrel that likes to pop her head out. Uh huh. There. Whole family of squirrels, actually. Yeah. I, so this is the the bedroom uh, area sleeping. This is this is actually the living room. Oh, the living room. Living room. Okay. The yeah. sleeping it's upstairs. Sleeping. sleeping is upstairs. So the bedroom Beautiful. doubles as my library. Yes, I see. Where I keep my books. Books up here. Uh, it's also. Um, my getaway space. So, if I have company and I just I have to get away, that's where I go. So when the kids are visiting <laughs> and they're down here making noise, you go upstairs. Yeah, it's quiet up there. Nobody bothers you. Also, I have a cat. So ah, you have know. plenty of room for cat. Plenty you should room. get like a, a, a hog, a dog, <laughs> and they all come in here. Goats. All... I'm thinking goats. goats. Yes. Goats. You need a goat rack for them. <laughs> a goat rack. Very good. See? We have entertainment. Somebody had birthday? He had a birthday. I had a birthday a few days ago. Happy birthday! Thank you, thank you. Uh, what's your name, darling? This is Shake. Shake. You're beautiful. Lovely, lovely, lovely cat. See, there's plenty of room. I don't know what you do when we aren't here to fill up this huge space. I don't know. <laughs> well, at one point I had 45 people uh, in the space with me. Um, we uh, we had wow. a tiny house, open house, and uh, at one point I invited them all in. So we had a few people up in the uh, loft area uh, and a dog. Have you thought of starting a tiny hotel? It's Tiny Circle. I want to thank Doug Williams, my new friend, for inviting me into his home and uh, to give us a little taste of tiny living.